Decontamination is the job of cleaning up or making harmless chemical agents, such as mustard gas and lewisite. These are liquid chemicals called vesicants or skin blistering agents. They are used in several ways. They can be sprayed by airplanes. They can be scattered by artillery shells. Or they can be spread by landmines. The purpose of these attacks is to cause casualties and slow the advance of our troops. Mustard and lewisite may remain on leaves and grass for days or even weeks at a time. And if they aren't cleaned up at once, they can easily cause many casualties. Every regiment or battalion ordinarily has a small unit especially trained in decontamination. This group works under the supervision of the unit gas officer and his NCOs. As a precaution, each man of the unit has a complete outfit of clothing which has been specially treated to protect him from mustard and lewisite. This allows the men to carry out their work with safety. The clothing is made up of a two-piece suit of cotton underwear and socks. A shirt and a pair of trousers which have been modified for better protection. And shoes and leggings which have also been especially treated to resist mustard and lewisite. In adjusting the hood, the men work in pairs. The hood is buttoned to the back of the shirt and left hanging until the contaminated area is reached. Masks are carried in the usual way. The hands are then covered with protective cotton gloves. Masks and hoods are not put on until the detail is near the gassed area. Complete equipment for the work is carried in a truck or trailer, one unit being provided for each battalion. Equipment and materials are made up of such items as shovels, axes, brooms, buckets, sprays, chlorinated lime and non-corrosive agent. 